we are at Long Doggers. Long Doggers. <laughs> long, 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 long Doggers. And this is Cheyenne, who is the most awesome waitress we've had on this whole trip. That, 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 now, it's not because she's the first waitress we've had either. <laughs> Hey, I'm Greg. I'm Felicia. And we are SCT Adventures, and this is... Cruise Day. That's exactly what it is. She beat me to it. Uh, that, was, that was unexpected. But we are sitting in our hotel, the Avid Avid Hotel. Avid. Are you sure that's how you say it? Avid. Well, but like the car rental place is Avis, and it's got an S, and it's spelled kind of the same. It doesn't really matter, but we're in a hotel, and we're getting ready to head to the port, as you can see behind us. I don't know. It's kind of... I don't know. It's kind of bleached out behind us, but we're in front of this big bay window. We're in Melbourne, Florida, fixing to head to Port Canaveral to get on the beautiful MSCC side. We had a good night's rest. We met up with our friends last night. See me traveling. If you didn't catch yesterday's episode where we ventured to the port and had dinner and hung out and did all sorts of things, it was a good time. Go catch that episode. But right now, we're not going to waste any more time. We're going to get in the car. We're going to head to Port Canaveral and see if this is a better MSC embarkation experience than what we had on the Maravilia. Fingers crossed. Y'all come on. Come on. Let's go. So we made it. Look, y'all, look behind us here. There she is. That's the MSCC side. We are here. We parked. Now, here's here's a caveat. Last time we were here, just a couple months ago, we did not, they did not make us prepay the parking. This time, they prepaid. They said it would help us get out of here quicker when we get back, which we're, exci no we're excited about because we were in that parking deck over yonder. We were in it for over two hours, sitting on like deck number four. We got a parking space down out front, down at the bottom here. Right right the por the porter's the right there. We're gonna run our luggage over there and drop it off at the porter's, give them some cash. And we're gonna go get in line to get on the ship. So we're not wasting any time. Y'all come with us. I hear a helicopter. Oh, a yeah. Squirrel moment. All right, let's go. We're getting on a ship. That yeah. one. Come on. So we dropped our luggage off with the porters. We're now crossing the road over here to get to the area. So we'll see how this is going to go. And then we'll check back in here in just a second. Listen y'all, totally different experience from the MSC Maravilia three months ago, two months ago, remember how long ago it was. This was quick. How, how long would you say from car to here? 15 minutes? If that. I mean, yeah. we're sitting in priority, priority and Kurt and Marcia are over in the other section. Hey, over there. Because we did status match and we're diamond. So we got to be over here in priority and Kurt and Marcia come by. We're what, all by ourselves. He got, he's got video of it, so this is gonna be funny. But we are sitting in priority. This was fast. I mean, it's partially because we got here early and got straight through. And we're the only ship in port today. Only ship in port. Security was a breeze. I don't know if I locked the key, locked the car or not. I locked it. <laughs> if you're, this is the first time you're watching our, our vlog series, you'd have to go back and check our Sunshine series for when I forgot to lock the car. But anyway, there's still people getting off the ship, so we're probably going to be sitting here for a little bit while longer. But it's air conditioned in here. Exactly. And we've got a nice comfy chair. Uh -huh. uh, I'm going to show you, this is what it looks like in here right now. There's not a lot of people. Um, but it's, hey, we're set up. We're gonna get on this ship here in just a few minutes and this is probably, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go out on a limb shy of, we had one other experience, I can't remember which one it was, where we just basically walked right on the ship. This is probably the second best experience we've had embarkation so far. That was sunrise, so wasn't it? 
It might have been Sunrise. It was one Riley was with yeah, us. Yeah, Sunrise. We walked pretty much on no, the ship. Freedom. The Freedom. Yeah, the Freedom. We walked right on the ship. But this has been the best experience. Second best experience so far. So MSC, props to you. You're working on it. And prepaying the parking. Parking's going to help us get out of here on when we get back. Um, we are. We like it. So. Anyway, we're signing out. Next time you see us, we'll be walking the gangway. Yay! So we made it on the ship in record time. I mean, this is, it's not even 11.30 yet and we are on here. The wait staff, awesome people already. They're phenomenal. These guys, they don't get enough credit on cruises for, for the work they do. I don't care whether it's Carnival, Royal Caribbean, MSC, whoever it is, these guys are great. There's Felicia, she's already coming over for, celebrating her nifty we're probably i got a feeling gonna have to relocate here in just a few minutes because we're we came straight in on deck i'm assuming this is probably deck five and it's gonna we're, we're literally some of the first ones on the ship so this area is going to fill up in a hurry and it's going to be busy here These people are going to pack in here and it's already warm on this deck because they got the door wide open so we may have to relocate to a different area but that's all right. We're going, we're going, we're going to hang out here for a few minutes and then probably go explore a little bit. But y'all, this is the best experience so far we've had with MSC. Of course, only second experience. And I'm just rambling on, but we're having fun. All right, so here's the deal. I've seen a lot of stuff on cruise ships. I got a question for MSC on this one. You know people drink on cruise ships. No. I don't need her chiming in right now because I'm, I'm, I've got a sincere question. <laughs> and Marsh is going to back me up on this one. Why, MSC, would you put a giant mirror that it looks is, like a hallway it is, it is, it is i've been not, sitting not here mean. for about 15 20 minutes watching multiple people walk into this mirror and i'm not going to say but one of us that's sitting here may have already walked into it a time or two so i'm going to zoom into this mirror over here. look at this mirror there's a giant mirror right, right here is felicia going to demonstrate the mirror Look at the mirror, right here. And it looks like a hallway, because you come out of this door, and there's a giant mirror. There is a bar right here. People are gonna get inebriated with the bar, and they're gonna come over here, and they're gonna go thinking they're walking right into that right there. Because it's polished. I mean. It's shiny. It's, it's polished, shiny, and they're gonna walk head first. I bet you they have to shine it every day and get all the nose marks off of it. <laughs> But I've been watching people walk into it for 20 minutes now. Watch it. Hold, hold. <laughs> I don't know why they would do that. How's this for a dining room experience? I mean, I hope it's the first night. I don't, I don't know. But we are standing in the atrium in line for dining room on the first night. I'm gonna pan this around so y'all can, can get an idea what this is like with this. This is kind of crazy, y'all. Let me show you. We're standing in line. The dining room supposedly, the dining room supposedly just opened up. And we've 
still got a long way to go. We still got to go all the way around here and back to where the elevators are to get in there to it. Yeah, we'll give an update. If it's like this every night, there's no way we'll do this. There's no way. <sighs> Come on, MSC. filmed hardly anything on this vlog and I told you I told y'all from the get-go we had people with us on this cruise and listen I'm not I'm not gonna put them on here look here's Madison gonna, hi there's Madison there's Josh over there we got Kurt Marcia and there's some people look I'm not even there's some people right here over there that don't want to be on the vlog so I'm not gonna pan the camera any further around but they're right here right I promise. Yeah, there's, there's their hand. Here's the deal. Let me tell you the kind of stuff that happens on a cruise. When you're a professional vlogger and you actually get paid from YouTube, the things you discuss on a cruise are what kind of vacuum cleaner. <laughs> what kind of vacuum cleaner are the people that are cleaning the rooms using? Because that's what they're Googling right now. What kind of vacuum cleaner just came by? So when you people... Like you need to show them. Show them. She's got it right there. Oh, okay, here. I'm gonna zoom in on the vacuum cleaner in question. Here it is. That's a nice vacuum cleaner. Can, will you That's hold a up, nice will you hold up you the vacuum cleaner? Can you see your vacuum cleaner? Please. That's a nice vacuum cleaner. This vacuum cleaner here is one in question that everybody is excited about. It's a... It's a it's a nif 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 nifis. They like your vacuum cleaner. It's not for money. Oh my goodness. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look, look at them. Look at them. Look at them. Look at them. That's right. They are so excited. They are excited about that. <laughs> How much suction? How much suction? <laughs> and of course, of co thank you. Thank, thank you. you so much. And of course, Felicia's question is how much suction does it have? We're in search of late night snacks. I have no idea if we'll be successful or not. Mad Madison is determined to be. I didn't think Madison was going to be in this vlog. I was told that Madison, that nobody else was going to, from our friends, were going to be in this vlog. I will always be in the vlog. Hi, everybody. I'm having a great time. So, late night snacks. We're documenting late night snacks. I got pizza, y'all can see right here. I have no business eating late night snacks, but here's here's an update, an update for you. I'm gonna pan down to Curtis down here. Y'all see what Curtis has got, let me zoom in. All right, Curtis? Yes, so, we have an update. Here on MSC uh, Seaside, uh, we have a dry weenie, not juicy weenie. Extra hard. Very dry weenie. I just put in my mouth. And if anybody knows about putting a weenie in their mouth, whether it's juicy or not, it would be Curtis. Yeah. So. I'm not like Greg. I don't like mine juicy. I like mine dry. Oh, no, I like mine there juicy. There you have it. There you have it. Curtis, Greg likes, likes, it. Curtis, Curtis likes, it. likes a dry weenie. I like You're mine the one that recommended it. I'm just okay. eating Well, it's been an eventful day, to say the least. I don't really know... I never know at the end of these things how much footage I actually captured. So I always say it could be a four minute video or it could be a 14 minute video. I don't know, but we're going to do our best to put together a vlog. Well, I guess if you're watching this, we put together a vlog. So what do I know? But it's been a fun day. We have had a fantastic time. Listen, we had fun with meeting, not meeting, but seeing Kurt and Marsha, seeing me traveling. Um, our friends Josh and Madison. Mm-hmm. 
Alan and Suzanne. Mm-hmm. And then we had the shock of our life seeing seeing and meeting in person. I mean, we've known her for the longest time. Her bestie. But we had no clue that Antoinette from Antoinette at Fun was on this ship. Got to see her, got to give her a hug mm-hmm. in the casino. That was so awesome. That that made the crew of uh, cruise, if I if I do say so. But there's been so much fun. Storm leaving when we were under a tornado warning leaving. But listen, all right. So we're gonna wrap up just a few things. MSC, you got a few challenges to say the least. Yeah, from the last time we cruised, y'all worked on some things, and on this time, you got some more things to work on. Now listen, now listen. This is a this is a public service announcement for all of you that that that, that you see paps. All right, listen. I'm probably giving out too much um, PPE here <laughs> um, for people that use yeah, medical equipment. But listen, <sighs> on MSC you fill out a special needs form. Special needs form, and they're supposed to provide you with some distilled water. I went to customer service and told them that the water... Now, when we were on the Maravilla, they... Uh, well, back up. We went to customer service after we tried speaking to the room stewards. <laughs> Several room stewards who did not understand what I was trying to tell them about I needed the distilled water. When we were on the Maravilla, when we got to our room, they had like a half gallon of distilled water in the room. It was not here today, nor was an extension cord because I forgot my extension cord, so... Anyway, so I went to customer service to which they got me an extension cord, which I'm not going to use. That's a whole other story. Maybe we'll talk about it in another video. But we heard a knock on the door, and they brought us the water. Now I'm going to turn this camera around and show you how they brought me my distilled water. Hold on. That solo cup that you see right there, that solo cup you see right there is my distilled water for my CPAP machine. Now, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm a little scared. <laughs> I'm a little scared about the water in the solo cup. So, <laughs> so needless to say, I'm not sure I'm going to use that or the bottle of water that's right there <laughs> for the CPAP machine. We shall have to, we'll just have to see. So with that being said, overall, it's been a fun time. We've, with any cruise line, I don't care what cruise you go on, nothing is perfect. But there has been some major improvements with getting on the ship and everything else. We've had a good time so far, and I plan on having a good time the rest of this cruise unless I fall off the ship. I don't do that. Well, you never know what could happen. But anyway, we're going to sign off for tonight because tomorrow's Ocean Key. We saw ready tomorrow. Ocean Key, yes. Oh, that's the other thing. <laughs> normally, y'all, I know we're rambling on at the end of this video, but normally we're in bed by like 10 o'clock on the first night of the cruise. Y'all, no joke. It is 1238 and I'm still up. It's it's a record for the first night of the cruise. So we have to turn in. We have been hanging out and just time went on with our besties and our friends and everybody. So we have got to to go to bed because I got to get up early in the morning and catch us pulling into Ocean Key. So we're going to sign off. I'm Greg. I'm Felicia. We are SCT Adventures and we appreciate you following along with Greg and Felicia and SCT Adventures and anybody else we can rope into this thing. We'll see you next time, guys. Bye. Bye.